Welcome everyone to this week's episode of My Life and My Virtual Therapy Dog channel. If you're new here, I'm Frank and this is My Life from My Point of View. With my voice by dad. I'm here for all the folks who want a dog but can't have one right now. Hi everybody, welcome to this week's video. This week we're uh, finishing up our uh, trip through the uh, Bandon State Natural Area. Let me stop and buy Face Rock. It's kind of where, where we're at here now. Face Rock, Elephant Rock, Cathedral Rock. Um, just uh, not too far south of Table Rock. That's where we're headed next, up to Coquille Point. And you'll want to be ready to pause the videos. There are a lot of storyboards in this, uh, in this video. So, and once we get up to uh, Coquille Point, you can see uh, Devil's Kitchen and whatnot. That was uh, last week's video. We explore a little bit further south. But when we get up to Table Rock, we'll uh, get to meet Gosmo. He's uh, like a five foot tall puffin made from garbage collected on the beach. I don't know if you saw those happy dogs down there on the beach. And these mir mirrors, mirrors, I, I don't know if I'm saying that right or not, but those birds, the, the little babies are born up on cliffs, one, one egg per couple. And then they jump off the cliff down into the water. Pretty amazing. And they're up from above. That's why we don't have drone footage. And it kind of makes sense that, the, you know, birds that are gonna, gonna eat them come from above and a drone would look like a really big weird bird. So, best not to freak them out. And seagulls. There's an amazing, amazing different kinds of, of seagulls. Or gulls, I guess. And just on cue. There they come. And there they go. Pretty, pretty views from here. And a pretty calm day on the ocean. Pretty pretty flat. Kind of low tide right now. So there's lots of beach. That's really the time if you're going to come come here. Oh, and I, I do want to mention also this. Uh, you, you could get around this trail with, with a wheelchair. And it's, it's just kind of a short walk around the point here. But most of it's pretty nice. And as you can see, pretty amazing views of the beach. And if you've watched any of the Backyard series, that's uh, quite a bit of stuff about the critters that uh, live in the tide pools and, and kind of near the beach and on the rocks and whatnot. Oh, Dad, Dad's, well, he's, he's wanting me to get up on that thing and sit there so we can get this week's thumb, thumbnail shot. <laughs> Almost had Pyrenees, Pyrenees lips going. There they were. Okay. Anyway. If you ever wondered how some of these thumbnail shots get created, this is it. And then Dad has a program where he goes in and, and steals a snapshot out of the video. Once in a while we shoot a regular video, but or a regular, you know, regular picture. But, oh, hang on, somebody's got to say hi. 
That actually took a few minutes. That, that little girl wanted to bury her head in me. And, well, sometimes you just have to let little, little short people do that because they need it. So, anyway, we're uh, on our way up to uh, Coquille Point. And that's uh, Table Rock and, and Cosmo. And also the, uh, oh, there's a bunch of, a um, bunch of islands out there. I can't, can't remember exactly what they're called. But anyway, here we are, Coquille Point. And I warned you early about all the storyboards. These, these are really good actually. And lots of information on them. There's Cosmo. Cosmo's actually made uh, from uh, garbage, trash, picked up on the beach. Yep, nothing was dyed or colored. That's the folks that did it. Combs, flip-flops, fishing poles, lighters. I just, really? Oh, man. Mom and Dad have a real problem with, with you know, people leaving trash. They pick up a pretty fair amount of trash. Dad's talked about making a backpack for me just so when we're out, he can put trash in it. But at least something pretty cool came out of uh, came out of that trash in Cosmo. So more about the birds. Those little did you know things are pretty cool. It's just stuff that you know you really didn't know. And this is a pretty short video this week, for sure. We uh, had a little too much for a single video, and and enough for you know last week's video, and and a fairly short video this week. But we'll end it with uh, watching waves crash through the rocks. They've actually battered a hole through uh, one of the big rocks down below. And who knew puffins lost all their, all their pretty Nine months out of the year when they're not mating. Pretty amazing. Nature's, uh, just kind of absolutely fascinating. Anyway, let's walk up and, uh, you can kind of see that hole through the rocks there. Gotta kind of wait for it, just, just a little bit. Water comes kind of crashing through. Wait for a, a decent roller to come in. I do want to thank all the subscribers and uh, everybody watching the video. Especially folks sharing. When you share the video, that uh, just helps more folks. So, until next week, have fun, stay safe. Cheers. Thank you so much for watching my video. If you like my videos, stick upon the thumbs up button. And for the newest, go ahead and paw that subscribe button. Thanks again. Cheers.